Hey guys, this is Zach Power Ace here today with part 6 of my LEGO tutorials for how to make uh, LEGO street buildings. Please rate, please rate, comment and subscribe and I hope you enjoy. Okay guys, well, uh, seem as though uh, the bay window is quite big, we're going to need quite a big plane to do it on. So, we're just going to go over here, zoom in, there we go. Now. This is our bay window, and because of hinges, it folds. Now, it opens up to this, but why is it called a bay window? Well, it's called a bay window because it's meant to bend like this, making a shape like that. This is the perfect shape to fit in our building. So how do we make it? Well, this is what we have to do. Sorry for that awkward moment of silence. Just got to get this whole thing off. There we are. All right. Two parts like normal. This part and this part. This part here is pretty special. If you don't do that part right, this part ain't gonna work. Uh, let's start with this one. Now, this is pretty easy. You're gonna need two hinges. You know, um, this might be a bit too far. I'm just gonna. There you are. All right. You're gonna need two hinges. Um, one of these windows. This is how I like to do them. Two one by two bricks, uh, white. Then you're gonna need six, I think, of these parts. There's just like this. There's a lot of them. Um, sorry, get them all in place. There are all of those windows, and that's everything we're gonna need for this part. Now, first thing we need to do to make it is take your big window and then get two hinges making sure the little ball is going this way so i'm going to take this stick it on like that so that you get this um this part i'm just going to zoom in a lot because otherwise you're going to find it really hard uh, now then we're going to get the other hinge and stick it on like this so you get that and this should be able to bend like that see now after that we're going to get one of these windows and stick it there stack another one on top of it then do the same on the other side. And now we have this. If you did that, that could actually be a really cool like a uh, frame for uh, like a music thing. But um, on the window side, uh, we're just gonna place in now uh, this and this. And the last two bricks is these two one by two bricks. Just gonna stick right like that. Now we made that. Let's work on the next part. So, next part over here. And now this will zoom in on a bit as well. And this part is gonna be confusing. It's gonna be tricky because <laughs> Well, this is the this is the brain. This is the important part. Now, this I'm not going to be able to exactly show you each part and everything that you need, but think of it like this. It's kind of like a snake. It bends, right? And if you do this, you can get kind of like a snake type shape. You know what I mean? So what we got to do, but you got to make sure that these hinges are on the right sides. This will end up being symmetrical. 
Now to do it, what you're going to need to do is start by making this thing. That's simple. A hinge like that. Then take two one by two uh, flat pieces and stick it on there. There we go. One part done. Now this part. Same thing. So get your hinge like that, but then take the two one by two things and place them there instead. So you're gonna have this, these two parts. All right now, next part. Um, we're gonna make this and um, that. These are the same. Uh, four hinges are two hinges stuck on top of each other for each one. And then what we're going to do is get this one by four and then just stick it underneath like that and then also stick it underneath like this. You'll get that. And now to make these two ones equal, stick each one of these on like this. And if you made that properly, you'll get a straight line. Now, to stick all of these together, you're going to have to do this. Watch carefully. Ooh. Two parts. Right? Now, we know with this that it bends along some lines. What we're going to kind of do is a shape that looks a bit like that. Right? So what we're going to do is get this 1x4 part. There's um, this part here this one by four part and then in this we have a one by four there stick that on like that and you can probably already see that when you stick this on everything else is going to want to stick on as well so then you're going to stick the one by twos beside the one by four onto the window one by twos and you'll end up getting that now your bay window is really complete um, if you want to make them higher, you can make bay window extensions. Watch this. Just put in hinges so that we make it high. Anyway, um, we're not going to need that yet, but it, ours will get extended. Bring the building along. And this is going to need zoom in. Ah. There we go. Okay. Now to get this in, is what you're going to want to do. Bend it so it goes like this, and it will get that, right? Stick this, the bottom, one by four there, onto this part here, just like this. Ah, let me get it into place. Here, like that. Stick that on. And then you'll have these two one by twos. One by two should secure this part here. The other one, move it over a bit and stick it on like that. There you go, bay window done. If you've made this correctly, it should look like that, okay? Pretty hard, but it turns out good. This little bit on the side here, you'll see we have a one by one left over. A small one by one spot coming off a hinge. Just there. What can we do? Well, why don't you make, you can turn it into a feature. I've made a lamp, just like this. I'm going to stick that on there. Just like that. Problem. Uh, this lamp is going to collide with the other building. So you're not allowed to really, that's the problem with it. So you guys are gonna have to figure out a solution. If you figure out a solution for it, let me know and you're awesome. Thanks for watching. See you next time in the next video. Bye.